Amazon has announced the launch of Rufus, the AI powered shopping assistant in the UK. In this video, I'm gonna tell you why this is so important for Amazon sellers and what you can do about it. Most people don't know what Rufus is, but let me explain a little bit about it. In the US on Amazon, they rolled out two things at the beginning of this year. One is called Cosmo AI and the other is called Rufus. Think of these as opposite sides of the same coin. Rufus is a shopping assistant where you can go on the Amazon app and you can type in that you're looking for a birthday present and it's gonna be able to ask questions and talk to you to find a product that's gonna meet your needs. Cosmo is the backend system making sure that that all works and also the Amazon listings are being presented to the right customer at the right time. This is a big update for Amazon sellers because the A9 algorithm is a thing of the past. Keywords, thing of the past. What's gonna be happening now going forward, it will be more based on the intent of the customer, how they're gonna use the product and their buying habits. Combining these two things, the Cosmo AI with Rufus, you have customers searching for what they want and the AI actually working out what they want and their normal buying habits, pairing up with the back end of Amazon that is analyzing your listings so that it can present the best product to the customer. What this means is that once this is fully rolled out, if you search for a dog lead and I search for a dog lead, we will get different results based upon our buying habits and our demographics. For example, if Amazon know that I've bought a large dog crate in the past, or I've looked for memorabilia for a border collie or something like that, it's gonna know that I have a large dog. It might know that I buy the most expensive products or the cheapest one or the one with the highest reviews or the ones that have got a deal active, it will then present me with the product that I'm most likely to buy. But your buying habits are gonna be different to mine, so when you search, it will present a different product to you. If Cosmo picks up that on the seller's listing, they have pictures of large dogs, and they know that I have a large dog, then Rufus is more likely to suggest that listing to me because it knows that the images are more relevant to me. You might think at the moment that everything's about SEO and keyword research, but that is going to shift or it has already shifted. Amazon rolled out Rufus and Cosmo to 10% of users in Q1 of this year in the US. They saw a massive uplift in sales because of that change. A few weeks ago, Amazon put out an update where uh, sellers had to update their bullet points and there was something hidden in there that said, use natural language. And just under a couple of weeks ago, Amazon put out this announcement. They are now putting the shopping assistant, Rufus, into beta testing in the UK. What that tells me is that this is 100% rolled out in the US completely, because normally everything's rolled out in the US first, it's tested properly, and then it's rolled out into the other marketplaces. So that tells me if you're a seller in the US, you need to be optimizing for Cosmo and Rufus and not about keyword SEO research for the A9 algorithm because that is going to disappear as time goes on. Over the next 6, 12, 24 months, this is going to be a massive change for Amazon sellers. So that gives you a bit of backstory about what the hell Rufus, what, what Cosmo is. I will link this page down in the, the description. But essentially what it's saying is that Amazon has been using AI expansively for 25 years and they are now taking the next step in AI powered shopping. You can see here over the past year, we've introduced a number of new generative AI powered capabilities on the Amazon store and, and they've done this for shoppers and actually for sellers as well. For example, they added the review insights that analyzes all of the reviews and gives you the synopsis, the overview of the, the good points, the bad points. That you can see here that customers in the US have already asked tens of millions of questions. And that would have made a big difference for them in terms of their revenue. For example, some people are saying, what do I need for making smoothies? And then Rufus is figuring out what they're gonna need and then providing them with those search results. They're also using comparisons like, should I get trail shoes or running shoes? And it will be able to ask the right questions to deliver the right answer to that customer and then show them the product that's gonna best match their needs. There's a really good example of how this works. The example is that a pregnant lady is searching for slippers on Amazon. Rufus and Cosmo are then providing potential products all with non-slip bottoms. And they know because of the buying habits of this customer that they are pregnant or they've just had a child and it's very important that they have non-slip shoes or non-slip slippers. In the listings of those sellers, it never says great for pregnant 
people. It doesn't detail that at all. But the AI knew it was an important feature and showed products that were the best match for that individual person. If you're in the beta uh, testing for the UK or if you're uh, a US uh, buyer, then on the right hand side, bottom right hand side of the screen, you'll see the little icon where you can open up the Rufus uh, conversation. And then you can literally just have conversations with it. This is taking shopping to the next level because you're essentially getting an online personal shopping assistant that knows everything. Once more people use Alexa to have proper conversations about what products to buy rather than just buying Amazon's choice, people are gonna use that a lot more and the uplift in sales that you could see from Alexa customers could be ginormous. You can see here customers can learn uh, what to look for while shopping in product categories. They can shop by an occasion or a purpose. I mean, great for when you need to buy your dad a birthday present. Get help comparing the options rather than having to click around different listings and go, well, I like this this one and this one maybe doesn't have that right information but this one does you can find the best recommendations or you can ask specific questions about a specific product if you want to learn how to optimize your listings for rufus and cosmo and you want to be able to do this sooner rather than later make sure you're subscribed with your notifications on because i'm going to be putting out a ton of content about exactly that that's it for today remember you're just one product away Bye bye